Yeah, totally we can. Good idea. I, yeah, let's I need it. to start <laughs> over again. <laughs> so, so because I just in right. case I'm not just in case I didn't record automatically, which is there. Oh, New York. <laughs> Yes, I know you can see New York in the back. Yes, drive through listeners. Guess who we have on the line today? We have Miss Tessa Suter. <laughs> I got it, I got it right. Tessa Suter on the phone this morning. Good morning, Tessa. Good morning. Thank you for having me. I'm excited to be here. Very nice. Oh, it looks bright. There's New York. It looks wonderful out there. Boy, I sure hope the weather matches what it looks like. <laughs> Yeah, no, it doesn't. <laughs> it really is cool, huh? Cool and crispy. It's going to be like 20 degrees or something later. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, well, yeah. well, I hear you're coming to the Bay Area. I hear you're coming I, to a Half Moon Bay. I am. I'm going to be at the Bark Dancing and Dynamite Society, which I'm super excited about, next Sunday, April 3rd, which is also my birthday. Oh, my goodness. Well, happy birthday ahead of time, just in Thank case I, 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 I don't make it, but I really want to make it. So Good, you're have invited. To yeah. Yes, that's <laughs> what I wanted to hear without asking. I love it. <laughs> All right. Well, Tessa Suter, let's see. What else is new? What have you been up to? Oh, gosh. What have I been up to? Uh, well, it's been a bit sort of since the, you know, a lot of my, I'm afraid to say I had this huge tour booked in Russia that was postponed in the fall due to COVID. Mm. And they said, oh, let's do it in the spring. And of course, now nobody's getting into or out. Of wow. Russia. I know that. Wow. But I, when I go to Russia, I usually play the, play the uh, Philharmonic Halls, a mixture of clubs, mm. but Philharmonic Halls. So um, I, I kind of missing that to tell the truth mm, i bet because yeah. they're beautiful people everywhere that audiences exactly. are beautiful jazz audiences exactly. are beautiful so yeah. so that's um that's kind of exciting but other than that i've just been sort of playing around in new york and um i've got some bunch of gigs coming up after california i'm going to charlottesville virginia mm. and uh lynchburg virginia and and then I'm going to play the Keystone Corner in Baltimore very, the week after. Very so nice. Busy so we're flurry of activity, and then I'm back in New York. Mm -hmm. So so what's your first stop coming out? What's your first stop? Uh, you mean this is my first stop? You mean? Um, yeah. Uh, you mean California? Yeah. That's Half Moon Bay. That's what I. So yeah. you're getting started out here, huh? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's going to be my first. I'm looking forward to that because it's very, it's very peaceful. New York's gone a little bit crazy lately. And hmm. So I'm kind of looking forward to kind of having that restful. Yeah. Yeah, that, that venue, that venue will definitely bring it about. Are you still there? I'm here. Well, I'm going to pause recording for a second. Okay. Yes, and we are recording again with Tessa Suter. Yes, we are. Coming to Half Moon Bay. That is the most important thing going on. Isn't it? Yes. <laughs> That's the next one. That's the biggie for me. That is, that is the biggie, along with your website, which is? tessasouter.com t-e-s-s-a-s-o-u-t-e-r.com tessa souter this this is all right it, it's i just like the view really i'm like i'm like looking oh, look at the art on the wall and yeah. look, feel, feels like i am in new york chilling <laughs> in the village right now let me tell you that is really? beautiful i could just sit here and stare out your window <laughs> That is so. That's what I used to do. I used to just sit here in the dark. Looking that is so outside. peaceful. Well, drive through, drive through, listeners. I'm sorry you can't see what we <laughs> see, but <laughs> but I'm sitting here looking out of Tesla Sutter's window in New York from right here in my studio. This is beautiful. It, it is beautiful, isn't it? I can't wait. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna make it up there to your show 
Tessa. Oh, I'm so this glad you are. Be beautiful. Yeah. And then I haven't seen Aristo since the uh, pandemic came about. Really? Oh wow. yeah, I know he's been putting out books and everything. And, and so Haristo's playing with you. Who else is playing with you, Aaron? You said Aaron Jermaine. And you're um, bringing, and I'm bringing Billy Drummond. Gotcha. Very nice. Yeah. Very cool. nice. And you're playing two sets at Bach da Dancing and Dynamite. Did I get it right that time? You did. Ah! <laughs> Love Dancing and Dynamite. That's fine. Very <laughs> nice. Yeah, very nice. And it starts at four thirty, and you can bring your own picnic. You can bring your own wine. You can bring your own food. Ooh. So, which is a good idea, I think. Then, I I agree. Yeah. I totally agree, and I see why for other reasons as well. You know, I yeah, thought about this being comfortable enough to oh, but that's very safe too. Yeah, exactly. That's true too. Actually, yeah. yeah. Bring your own little picnic. Yes. Lovely. Yes, and um. I uh, might bring cake. I don't know. <laughs> since my birthday I oh think. yes it will be your birthday that will that's an awesome celebration it is, that's it? that's an awesome celebration yeah actually i should look at my uh, uh astrology for having my birthday in half moon bay i never thought about that well pacific ocean you and cake yeah. <laughs> good music you know what else could there be exactly what yeah. else could there be my goodness this, this feels so good and so natural it feels like i've known you for a while even with the technical difficulties you know it is what it is this is live man yeah you know that's great and if and if it, i put it like this tessa and if it's okay with you if I play back this audio and this video and it's nothing that I'm like happy with, I'm going to call you or, or yeah, or some kind of way we're going to talk. If this doesn't work at six o'clock, my time, <laughs> Tuesday morning, oh my Lord. <laughs> we're going like, to go live. That'll be nine. That'll be nine. Your time. Nine. My time. Is morning. Tuesday, leave Tuesday morning nine open for me. How about that? Oh, let's pray that doesn't happen. I know, and if not, you know, but but we we if not, I'm gonna play blurbs and it's gonna be fine. Fantastic, thank you. You are so welcome. Is there anything else you want to tell the listeners? How's your like where they can find your music other than your website? If you're on the digital streams, well, yes, yeah, Spotify and. Uh you know, all those streaming platforms, yeah. Amazon. Um, but that's all kind of, you can sort of access absolutely everything from the website. So you can look at the website and you can see where, to, I've got lists of where you can buy each album. Very and, nice. um, yeah, but yes, but you could just put my name into Spotify and it comes oh, Is it true you're an author too? Uh, yeah, I I mean, I've written one book. I'm actually working on writing. It's a sort of secret right now, but I'm... Mm, I'm how do I writing. know? Yeah, I'll tell you about it later. All right, cool. Yeah. Uh, it's about, it's, um, <laughs> you I wrote I. a book called Anything I Can Do, You Can Do Better, which was okay. kind of a friend of mine suggested that I wrote this, and I, I didn't even think of it. And then one day I was talking to this woman who was an agent, a literary agent and I just happened to mention to her that my uh, friend had said oh I should write a book about how I got started and all I have a lot of friends who've done really well as well and um well nice. uh, unlike me I mean I'm not saying I've done really well but they've really done well I hear you. And, uh, yeah. so um but who I've known for many years you know before anyone was doing it mm -hmm. um and uh, so there are a lot of them are in the book too, like mm -hmm. authors and actors and, and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's basically, it's about, it's divided up into different chapters, dealing with money, dealing with getting started, dealing mm -hmm. with nerves, dealing with how do you keep going when you just don't feel like it anymore, you know, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. And um, uh, Random House in the UK bought it. And so it came out, on, uh, you know, with them. Mm -hmm. and uh in england and so they've got the rights to it and the kindle and then i also put it out my kept the rights and put it out myself very on nice. kindle That's here wonderful. yes so um yes see and it's cheap it's like dirt cheap my version over here which is actually an updated version and yeah. since i wrote yeah. the first one some of the people in it like 
one of my friends is this uh, is an author. She wrote a novel called Disclaimer. Okay. And uh, at the time, she was still playing Patience, and on she was going up to her writing shed and just playing Patience in there, and, you know, not getting on with her work at all. And now, yeah, her novel has just been made into a TV show for Apple TV by the wow. guy who won the Oscar for Roma. Wow. And another one of my friends um, is. Quite a bit of him is anonymously in the first book because it, it, it's not, it has to be anonymous. But um, he became, um, he's sudden, I mean, he's like in his 60s and he suddenly started to do really well yeah. when he got, he's in Outlander and he's uh, okay. Dougal in Outlander. So yeah. it's yeah. just, it's incredible how, you know, you could just be bumbling along and you've no idea what's going to happen. Like my mm. friend Rene was, over 50 mm -hmm. and um graham was well i forget how old graham is he's probably mm -hmm. 61 or something like that now yeah and but his success really came i mean late for an actor you know what i mean mm -hmm. they want to be everyone wants to be a movie star when they're like in mm -hmm. their 20s or 30s but right. they're actually if there's anyone out there listening Guys, <laughs> yes so too late for me. No, no. It is not too late. Yes. You can really do stuff. And yes. Really Thank you. That was for me. I'm listening. Oh, good. 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 <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'll have to give you the book. I'll have to give you the book. That's so, awesome. So that was that one. And then I'm also working right now on a, I'm talking, I'm in talks yeah. with this very interesting. Uh, person who I approach because I thought that story I'll tell you about it when I see you though um is really an amazing amazing story that I, that I think people should hear and be educated about understood understood yeah, yeah you you you're laying it out here me throwing some gems out here making yeah, me want, love making, it. making me want more you know yes, <laughs> yes definitely definitely <laughs> Okay, yeah, well, my priority, I think. Right man, you, you've given us so much, so much um, information, you know, you're leaving me intrigued. And so drive through listeners, we're speaking with Tessa Suter, an international, uh, just acclaimed artist, uh, I'll just say artist, and you, you, you fill out, fill in the rest <laughs> when you check her out. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, I, I want to say that and she's coming to uh, Half Moon Bay. I don't even want to take a third swing at this one. What's the venue called? <laughs> oh, I'm dancing in Dynamite Society. See, there you go. So that's the name. And that's going to be Sunday. It's going to be her birthday. And your uh, time, the sets are uh, what time? Well, it starts at 4.30. It ends at 7. And we're going to put in two sets in that time. There'll be a little break in the middle. Very And good. also that we, we, we can offer... Um, the venue, Bach Dancing and Dynamite Society, is offering a pair of tickets, giveaway tickets. So okay. The first, the first person that calls in and claims. And, and I also will give them a, my latest CD if they would like to. There you go. There you go. Drive through listeners. Don't call right now. <laughs> Let us finish the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like that. Uh, <laughs> That's a suitor. It has been, uh, it has definitely been a privilege of mine and an honor of mine to, to have you on the drive through. And I really appreciate your patience uh, and for getting up this early with us. I appreciate it. <laughs> and, look, very and look forward to seeing you uh, this Sunday. And, yeah. Oh, great. I can't wait to actually see you in person. That'll be fun. Very nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Okay. Have, have a good night. Bye. Bye-bye. Are we staying on? No. <laughs> <laughs>